With a golden mane, regal stride, and powerful strikes, but above all, incredibly courageous. This lion had his name immortalized in the lands of Uganda for his bravery in leading his pride, protecting his offspring, and overcoming the agony of a bitter betrayal. Captured through the lenses of wildlife photographer William Lucas, Spartacus was revealed to the world as the true Lion King. Today, you'll learn the story of Spartacus the Lion and how his bravery in governing a vast territory made him a king known worldwide. This lion even faced a coalition of four male lions and still emerged alive. So, hit that like button right away, and if you're not subscribed yet, consider subscribing. Click like, and let's get into it. In 2011, in the Kidipo Valley National Park, Uganda, Africa, covering 1,442 square kilometers of savannas, rivers, and rocky terrain, two adult male lions made their presence known. The park, located in Uganda, is home to hundreds of wildlife species, including lions. Early in the year, these two adult male lions appeared near the park and caught the attention of observers due to their remarkable beauty. Despite being adults, their manes were well-preserved, suggesting two possibilities. Either they had avoided conflicts, or they were skilled fighters who rarely sustained damage to their manes. The latter theory proved true, as this lion duo quickly became the dominant figures in the area, overthrowing the two existing dominant males. They roamed for many days, closely monitored by reserve workers. They mapped out the area and chose the center of the park to establish themselves. However, that territory didn't have just one, but two powerful owners. There were already two prides of lions established in the center of the park, each with two dominant males coexisting in the same region, respecting each other's territorial boundaries. The first challenge for the lion duo presented itself to overthrow the kings of that territory. And so they did, succeeding in both fights. The park workers noticed that one of the two brothers was different, not only due to his powerful presence, but also his fighting style. He was faster, better at dodging, and counter-attacked before his opponent could react. Perhaps this was why the lion had such a beautiful, almost intact mane. His unique style of battle earned him the name Spartacus, reminiscent of the strong Spartan warriors of ancient Greece. Now, the central area of the Kadepo Valley Park had two new kings. Everything indicated they were brothers and successful, but Spartacus stood out in everything compared to his throne companion. The two kings defeated the offspring of the old lion and managed to gain acceptance from the lionesses as their new leaders. They took turns patrolling and leading the prides, but whenever possible, they stayed together, strengthening their bond. New generations carrying their DNA emerged, and in mid-2012, another male lion attempted to claim the throne. Spartacus was out hunting with the lionesses while his brother awaited the feast. Spartacus was attacked unexpectedly without his fighting companion, but he managed to swiftly emerge victorious. Indeed, his fighting style lived up to his name. However, in 2013, everything changed. Unbeknownst to Spartacus, envy grew in his brother's heart, and he desired to become the greatest leader those lionesses had ever seen. It was night, and Spartacus was with one pride while his brother led another, as was often the case. At least, that's what Spartacus thought. That night, Spartacus's brother plotted to become the sole ruler of both prides. He launched a surprise attack on Spartacus in the dead of night, and the roars of their battle echoed in the distance. The clash between those glorious kings persisted until dawn, when Spartacus ultimately slew his brother. However, unlike their previous fights, the weight of betrayal and the agony of loss weighed heavily upon him. Spartacus emerged as the sole victor, the only king, but his heart needed to comprehend all the events of that night in an orderly manner. After all, the fight had lasted so long because Spartacus had avoided delivering a fatal blow, hoping his brother would relent. But when he realized there was no other way, he had to end his journey companion right in the heart of the territory they had conquered together. For a few days, the lion seemed confused or unwilling to believe in his brother's attempted betrayal. Spartacus roamed from one pride to another, seemingly searching for his brother, whom he had been forced to defeat. He even left his pride a few times to be alone. It was his way of coping with the pain. However, a king has responsibilities to fulfill, and protecting his pride is the foremost among them. Spartacus needed to face the truth 
and return to ruling coherently, as the destiny of a lion dictates. Spartacus managed to unite the two prides, allowing him to focus solely on night patrols while spending his days with his lionesses and cubs. In 2014, Spartacus gained worldwide recognition as the true Lion King, thanks to a photograph taken by professional wildlife photographer William Burrard Lucas. The photo captured the exact moment when Spartacus climbed a rock to observe his kingdom. This photo led to comparisons with the character from Disney's The Lion King II, Simba's Pride, where Simba is depicted as an adult king. William Burrard Lucas described the scene, noting that it was late afternoon with perfect lighting, and he had hoped Spartacus would climb the rock. Remarkably, the lion seemed to hear his request and began walking toward it. In William's words, I was pinching myself when he started climbing. He sat exactly where I hoped and then looked at me with his royal gaze. I couldn't believe my luck. It's so rare for a wild animal to actually do what you want. Before me was a scene straight out of The Lion King. The sun reflecting off his golden mane made the King Spartacus even more imposing. In the same year, four males had formed a coalition and were heading towards Spartacus's territory. They fought for many days, engaging in individual and collective battles. At times, the lionesses attempted to intervene to aid the king, but Spartacus would drive them away to preserve them from possible harm. In the final fight, Spartacus faced the four lions alone, yet he managed to emerge alive. The lions retreated but remained on the lookout. The next day, Spartacus disappeared and was never seen again. It is believed he succumbed to his injuries or entirely relocated due to the presence of the four new lions, who were not about to give up easily. Three days after his disappearance, the four lions took over Spartacus's unified pride and became the kings of the central area of the park. Spartacus was a brave warrior and a king with loyal subjects who overcame the betrayal of his brother and still managed to live his days in glory. Do you know any more information about the lion Spartacus that we haven't covered in this video? Please write in the comments and help us expand our knowledge. If you haven't already, now is the time to click the like button. Consider subscribing if you're not already subscribed. If you enjoyed this video, then binge watch our channel. Remember to share it on your social media and groups you're a part of. Thank you very much for watching.